Hello, it's Matt and welcome to Collaboration Coach. This is another Microsoft Teams video. And before we get started, I just want to remind you that I'm posting videos every week at the moment. So please subscribe if you don't want to miss anything. In this video, I'm going to show you how to publish a SharePoint page in your Microsoft team. So the reason you might do this is if you want to create a good looking page, which is what SharePoint is good at, you can create pages, you can add text and images and all sorts of other integrations like Facebook and Bing Maps to a page and you can do it really easily without a lot of technical knowledge. That's something that Teams doesn't do so well. So you can create your page and publish it in SharePoint and then present it in your Microsoft team. So what I've done here in my SharePoint team site, I've created a news post, which is this one called Mark 8 Announcements. If I open this up, you can see I've added an image, some text, and then down the bottom here, I've just added uh, a Bing Maps integration. So there's an interactive map as part of the page. Now this is accessible to anyone who's a member of this Mark 8 project team group and the group has a Microsoft team attached to it. So if I switch over to Microsoft Teams, you can see here's my Mark 8 project team team and I'm in the marketing channel here. What I'm going to do is add that SharePoint page to a tab in this Microsoft team. So all I need to do for that is come to the plus button in the tab section, choose SharePoint, and then what it's going to do is look for all the pages that are available in my SharePoint site. And you can see one of them is the Mark 8 announcement page. So all I have to do is select and save that. And then it's going to publish that in my Microsoft team. And you can see I've got a new tab called Mark 8 announcement, which is the name of the page. If I scroll down, you can see I've got the interactive map here. So I can use Bing Maps, I can zoom in and out and so on. And once the page is here, I can also then have conversations around it. So everybody who's a member of my team now can chat around the page. So perhaps if this was something that was a work in progress that I wanted some feedback on, this is where other members of my team could come and make comments about my page and perhaps recommend some changes I should make. So in this video, we looked at how to publish a SharePoint page in a Microsoft team. Thanks for watching and if you like these videos please share them with your friends and don't forget to subscribe because I'm publishing new videos every week.